Hi YouTube, I'm back and today I'm going to be doing a video for you guys to show you how I customize my home screen. Um, let's just go ahead and get right into it. Um, I'll tell you guys the particular apps I use, kind of just show you a little bit how it works. Um, I'm sure a lot of you have kind of heard of all these, but um, it just kind of, this will be just kind of a quick, easy way to show you how to get your home screen to look like mine if you wanted to. The main app, the first app that I use is pretty much the main one um, that kind of gives you the whole setup is the ADW Launcher. Um, they do have ADW Launcher on the Play Store for free. Um, I use ADW Launcher X from Aptoid. Um, it, well, it does. It is on the Play Store and it costs um, a couple of dollars, but I got it for free off of Aptoid. Um, but the, the just the regular ADW launcher works just fine, so don't worry about that. Um, I also use Coco PPA and Icon. That's how I change my icons. These I didn't change yet because I'm going to do that for the video. I'm going to show you um, how to do it so they still look regular. But um, those are the two, and they're both free on the um, Google Play Store. Um, so that's Coco. Oh my gosh. Co Coco PBA and I well it says icon changer but it's I mean if you type in icon or icon changer it will pop up um, also to get my wallpapers to fit my screen properly I use image to wallpaper image the number two wallpaper and it looks like this that's what it will look like once you um, download it um, and that's how I get them to fit my screen properly without being distorted or fuzzy or just not not fitting it right because a lot of um, the cute um, the cute wallpapers are like made to fit an iPhone because iPhones are so popular. Um, they're made to fit iPhones, well they have such small screens so it ends up looking really stupid on your bigger Android screen. So um, I use that to make them fit. Um, the places that I get my wallpapers from are definitely Pinterest, We Heart It. Those are my two favorites. And then I also, of course, Google. Google is a great place to find wallpapers. Um, I normally try to Google icon skin wallpapers, icon shelf wallpapers, and icon frame wallpapers. That's where you will get, like, the shelving for your icons and, um, like, if you want them to be in little frames, like the little square um, wallpapers that has little frames for your um icons they a lot of them will pop up in that and also like I said Pinterest really has a lot of those they really really do so um that's where I get those I believe this one came from Google if I go yeah I'm pretty sure um now the font you guys were asking about how I changed my font for up here the only way you can change system font is if your phone allows it. A lot of LG phones are now allowing you to do it, which it will be in your settings. I will show you real quick. Um, it'll be in your settings under display and Samsung. Sam oh, I hit sound. Samsung phones, a lot of them, most of them, especially if they're pretty current, they allow um, you to change your fonts. This phone only allows me to change the few that they have here. You can't download more. Um, on my Samsung Galaxy S3 you can download from the internet and just have a whole bunch of them. Also for most other Samsung phones you can as well. So unless you root your phone, which I don't suggest because um, your, your um, warranty will be voided, um, unless you want to do that, you won't be able to change your font unless you have the option to already in your phone. So, um, sorry about that, but that at least answers you guys' question. Okay, so now that I've kind of told you everything, um, kind of broke it down for you, I'm going to go into these two apps and just do, I'll do one for this and one for We Heart It, one for Pinterest. Um, and each one of them, I'll pick probably... Coco PAPA. 
I can't, I always like stutter with that. I don't know why, I'm sorry. But I'll use that to get, find the one for Pinterest and then we'll use eye, eye crown for um, We Heart It and I will put them right here so you can kind of see how it works. And then that will kind of wrap up this video. I mean, it's not very difficult. Um, oh, also I meant to add, this is, this little clock part, is HD Widgets. I think it is a paid app on the App Store or on the Play Store, but um, I believe they have it on Aptoid. Um, I will be doing a video hopefully later, sometime this week definitely, um, that will kind of show you guys this rewards program for answering surveys. It doesn't spam you. They're just quick, easy surveys, and you earn money to use specifically on the Play Store. So you can actually get apps for free just by building up your money on that. That's where I get some apps. That's definitely where I got this one. Because otherwise I just wouldn't have purchased it. But I just thought it was kind of cute because it's free money to use on the app store. Or on the play store, sorry. So that's what that is. HD widgets if you are um, interested. Alright, I'm doing this through a camera view. So if I look kind of weird and um, I don't know if I press the wrong thing or something just bear with me but okay you saw that it had just like closed there for no apparent reason sometimes that happens but normally if you go right back into it it'll be fine it's really not that big of a deal I normally I mean you can get hot home screens which comes with the wallpaper and the um, icons like whole packs of them you can here are the hot icons um, you can get just the wallpapers right here I'll oh, see there we go I told you I'd hit something but those are just the wallpapers but I normally go all the way down and I go to keyword enter keyword so I click that Let me, okay I click that so that um, it's easy for me to just go in and find what I'm looking for rather than searching through millions. Well, not, maybe not millions, but there are a lot, a lot. And it will, I mean, it's fun to get into, but sometimes it will take up a lot of your time. You'll just get lost in it. So I normally like to just search for what I'm looking for. It makes it quick and easy. Um, sorry, guys, I'm trying to hit the search button. I don't know why it's not letting me. Hold on one second. Let me switch hands here. It's a little shaky. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's try this one more time. I figured I was going to have some trouble doing this through the screen. There we go. Okay. So look at how cute these are. And they literally have pages and pages and pages. Like you can go on and on. Like it's hard for me to scroll through this camera. So I'm not going to do too much because I'm going to end up hitting one that I don't want to hit. But see, look at look at how cute these are. I liked this one up here. I'm, I love Chevron. So I'm going to get this one. And what you'll do is just hit use this icon down here at the bottom there we go and then it'll pop up you can use it for any application you have like a lot of them don't have a particular app picture on it they have just like generalized pictures so you can literally use them for anything you want they also have shortcuts here so that if you maybe want to text your best friend have like a um a shortcut to get to just texting exclusively her you can pick out a cute little like icon for that like a heart or something and then you'll be able to just directly from your home screen click it and it will go right into your text messaging app to text that particular person which I think is awesome but here we'll press the Pinterest and then hit OK and it's there let's look at it see it's right there there's my Pinterest you do you cannot delete like, now that I have this, I will not delete this app because this is not, this is just a, kind of like a shortcut. Um, when I click it, it will go directly into Pinterest. It won't take me to, like, a website or anything, which is good. Um, but it is not, like, a replacement for the app. So you have to remember that. But I can take this and then just remove it from my home screen. And there we go. I have the cute Pinterest um, icon right there. And now we'll do, we'll go to Icron and do one for We Heart It. This one takes longer to load up. 
it can get a little annoying, but it's not that bad. And the icons in here are so cute that it really doesn't make a difference unless you're like extremely impatient. Okay, with this one though, they have, um, well here you can search, I guess you can search here, but they have by application, by tag, and by color. So you can kind of like go through if you want it all to be pink, like I love pink, or all purple, green, something like that. Um, you can click there and um, look for a specific color. So I thought that was really cool. See here, I clicked on just their um, icons that they have, or their their apps that they have icons for, and there's so many, Line, YouTube, Facebook. Let's see if they have some for We Hardy yet, or not. I'm sure they do, but let's see, they may not. Haven't tried yet. WeChat, I know the, um, the focus isn't very great, guys, I'm sorry. It's gotta be annoying, I know, but... Especially considering I know how you feel because I'm looking through here too and it's very weird. Let me just try to look over the camera while I see if I can find it. See, and I didn't find it. Let me go back and try to type it in here because I was before but it's really not like wanting me to do it. Let's see. Oh, okay, yeah, you can't actually type in there. That was my mistake. You can just go through and find, like, the colors here. Here is some um, apps that you can try to find them specifically for. Let's see if they have... I know I'm moving a lot, guys. I'm sorry. Let's see if they have a Wee Hearted or not. I'm not seeing it. Um... This one is more of an app that you would want to, like, just go through, like I said, find a specific color. Um, they do have a lot of the popular apps, but they don't have all of them. So, um, I'm sure there are some We Hot, oh my gosh, We Hard It ones in here, but I really don't want to take the time since we're actually on a video here to look for it. So, I'm going back to Coco PPA, and I'm going to hit back, back. Now we're back on the home screen. Go down. I just showed you guys this, so I know it's not like anything exciting, but we'll just find it real quick so that I can have it. I don't think it's all one word, is it? What the heck am I doing? Oh, jeez. Okay. And then, of course, I can't even like type with my big old thumbs. While I'm doing it through here. Okay. There we go. I think we're finally rolling. Okay. See? Look at all these for We Hearted. And like I said, I'm pretty sure, I'm almost positive that the other app has it as well. But like I said, it was just taking too long to find it. So I just decided to go in here and get it. And then we'll do the same thing. Use this icon. You guys, this clicking thing through the camera. Okay, there we go. Let's just get moving. Hit OK, and it's been placed, so let's see. There it is. Focus for the people. Yeah, it's not going to focus. Let me try this. Look at that. It's beautiful. Okay, so, yeah, guys, this is, oh, one thing I also want to say before I go, and I'm sorry I'm wobbling and everything, but the reason I love the ADW um, launcher with these these shelf um, wallpapers and stuff is because of this. I, I am going to be doing another video for um, some other launchers that I love too because there are a lot of good ones out there. But the reason, I like I said, if I'm using this kind of background or a frame one or anything like that, this is why I do it. Because on... This, they have a resize screen option. You can move the icons to sit where they're supposed to sit on the um, shelf or in the frame. So I think that's awesome because a lot of other ones don't offer that and it kind of ends up looking very weird. So if you are going to do the I, the icon shelf wallpapers or the frames I definitely suggest getting the ADW launcher um it's awesome so um I hope you like this video um I plan on doing a lot I'm saying um all the time sorry I don't know why 
I plan on getting um, plenty more out. I know this one was kind of late, and I'm sorry. With the holidays, I kind of got a little off schedule. But, yeah, it was great to film this for you guys. Like, thumbs up, and subscribe. Spread the word if you're liking it. Like I said, um, if this YouTube channel starts to get good, I'll buy a much better camera so I'm not, like, shaking all the time. And I have plenty, plenty of apps and awesome ways to customize your phone if you guys are interested. So, I'll keep making the videos if, if you like them. Thank you so much and bye.